Hello viewers, viewers, welcome to Destined to Win Tutorials. Today we're going to treat the continuation on matrix where we'll look at how to solve for determinant, transpose of a matrix and also the inverse of the, mat of the matrix. Now, what are determinants? Determinant is a single element or number used as in used to represent a given matrix. Now, for example, if we have a two, we're looking for a two by two matrix, determinant of a two by two matrix, and we're giving P as this, two, one, three, four. Determinant of P is represented as this, so, here, to get a 2 by 2 matrix determinant, all you need to do is say 2 times 4 and 1 times 3. 2 times 4 minus 1 times 3. So what do we have here? We have 2 times 4 minus 1 times 3. And this will give us 8 minus 3. And this will give us 5. So determinant is a single element or number that represents a given matrix. Also, to get the determinant of a 3 by 3 matrix, we have, let's say we have A as this, 3, 3, 4, 1, 2, 2, 4, 1, 0. Let's put this sign here. Now, what we are going to do is looking, we are going to use the minor of this particular ele uh, element, this first row. So, the minor of 3, cancelling this um, row and cancelling this column, we have 2, 1, 2, 0. So, this is, and we'll put 3 with the sign. 3, determinant of 2, 1, 2, 0. The essence is to break this down to a 2 by 2 matrix so we can solve for determinants. So here we have minus 1. Cancelling this, cancelling this. What do we have? We have 3, 1, 4, 0. So here we have 3, 1, 4, and 0. Then your sign plus 4. Cancelling this, this we have 3, 2, 4, 1. So here 3, 2, 4, sorry, 2. So what do we have here? We have 3 into bracket. 2 times 0 is what? 0 uh, minus 2 times 1 is 2. 1 bracket. This time is still 0 minus 4 times 1, 4 plus 4. This times this, we have 6. And this time, 4 times 2 minus 8. So what do we have here? It's equal to 3 times minus 2, we have minus 6. And also, minus 1 times minus 4, we have what? Plus 4. And here, 4, this 6 minus 2, what will it give us? To give us a minus 2. Minus 2 times 4 is a minus 8. So here, what do we have? We have a minus 6 plus 4, that's minus 2. And minus 2 minus 8 will give us a minus 10. So this is how we solve for a 3 by 3 matrix. So how do we solve for a uh, transpose? If we are given a question to find the transpose of a matrix. So the transpose is just a rearrangement of a particular matrix. For instance, let's say we have a 3 by 3 matrix as this. A1, A2, A3. B1, B2, B3, C1, C2, C3. The transpose represented as AT will just, this will become a row, this column will change to a row, and this column will change to a row. So the transpose of this 3 by 3 matrix is A1, A2, A3, B1, B2, B3, and C1, C2, C3. So this is this is it. Now for a two by two, two matrix, for example, <clears throat> let's say we have this A is equal to two three one four. 
and they said find a t the transpose of this matrix now to find a transpose of a two by two matrix what do we do we would interchange the principal diagonal take four here bring two here, down so we have four and two here then multiply a minor sign to the ordinary diagonal the, the elements on the ordinary diagonal so we have a minus one and minus three so this is how we easily find the transpose of a two by two matrix also how do we get the inverse of a matrix The inverse of a matrix is just gotten by the reciprocal of the given matrix. That is, A is equal to A minus 1. And to get A minus 1, the formula is equal to the transpose of A divided by the determinant of A. You could also state this as this. That's A determinant multiplied by A T. 1 divided by determinant of A multiplied by the transpose of A. So this is the formula to get our inverse of a matrix. In the next video, we shall solve past questions from JAMB on determinants, transpose, and inverse of a matrix. Thank you for staying tuned to Destined to Win Tutorials. Please subscribe, like, and share this video. Bye.